Your girl is big chillin' today. I am not in my full glam like y'all normally see me, but I wanna talk cameras today because I picked up a new vlogging camera and I'm excited about it. So I wanted to unbox it with y'all today. So I just got back from Best Buy and let's talk about this vlogging setup and let's set it up right now. So first up, we have this vlogger kit accessory. This is a like tripod grip that you can use for the bottom of your Sony camera. So definitely wanted to grab this. It's perfect for vlogging. You can turn the camera on and off. You can zoom it, you can take photos, a bunch of different things. And it also came with a memory card. I'm not gonna be using this memory card for my new camera, but I'll be using this for the camera I'm currently filming with. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the box. And it was inside of another box. <laughs> So this is called the Sony Shooting Grip with Wireless Remote Commander. And this retails for $149.99. So it does come with this bag that you can put your tripod in when you're not using it. And here is the tripod. So it's super easy to just grip and hold when you're like pointing the camera out like this at yourself when you're vlogging, which is exactly why I got it. And then you can see all the different controls on it, which makes it super convenient. If you're using any Sony camera, like I can use it with my current camera, then I definitely recommend you picking this baby up. I will have everything linked below in the description box if any of you are interested. Next up, I picked up this memory card and this is the SanDisk Extreme. Pro 128 gigabyte. This is the V90 and I got this one because the Best Buy associate recommended doing the V90 for the new camera that I got. I know y'all don't know what camera I have. I'm saving it to the end so y'all gotta watch the whole video okay. I also picked up a new lens for this camera. This is the Sony FE 20 millimeter f1.8 so let's open this baby up this is a full frame lens sony has f and fe lenses make sure if you have a full frame camera you get an fe lens because i've made the mistake of getting the incorrect lens and yeah no good so everything always comes packaged so great with sony i'm a sony girl i used to be a canon camera girl but i'm a sony girl like look at that it comes with such a gorgeous case. So here is the 20 millimeter prime lens. It has an f-stop of 1.8. So it's going to give me that nice blur in the background like you see on this camera too. The lens I'm currently shooting with is also an f1.8 lens. So this is my sweet spot. I love prime lenses. And it also comes with a lens hood. So we'll put that to the side and let's get into the camera that I picked up. Did you guess what camera I got? Let me know what vlogging camera you think I picked up in the comment section down below. Don't cheat. Comment right now. So the box doesn't look like much. It is a Sony Alpha camera. And I went with the ZV-E1. Ah, I'm so excited, y'all. So excited for some bomb vlogging content. I know y'all have been wanting to see more vlogs and different types of videos. So this camera is gonna help me achieve just that. So let's open this baby up. Of course, it comes with all your paperwork up top. We're gonna move that to the side because you know we don't read the paperwork. And everything just comes packaged so beautifully. Oh, I forgot to mention the lens because I wanna tell you all the pricing just in case any of you are interested in checking out these items and purchasing it for yourself to create content content but this lens is $899.99 and I can use this with any full frame Sony camera. You can also use the full frame lenses on a crop sensor but you don't want to use a crop sensor lens on a full frame because it can cause some vignetting. So back to the camera let's go ahead and take it out. I just got the camera body. Look at that. 
It's so beautiful, so beautiful. So it does have a flip out screen so you can look at yourself as you're vlogging. I'm not gonna get into all the specs because I don't have that type of channel, okay? This is a beauty channel over here. If y'all want the specs and everything, you can go on Sony's website or you can check out a ton of videos because I've been binging all these videos. But it also came with this strap here. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and attach the lens to the camera. So I went ahead and took off the bottom and I'm going to take the lens hood off of the camera sensor area. Go ahead and pop our 20 millimeter lens on it feels so lightweight in my hand I love that now let's go ahead and open up the tripod and then I'm going to attach the camera to the tripod I'm actually gonna put it down and do it so I don't mess up I'll be right back so I went ahead and attached the tripod to it. And this is what we're working with. It's very easy to just hold and film yourself with, which is exactly what I was looking for. It feels very nice and secure and it doesn't feel heavy whatsoever. So I'm gonna go ahead and pop the memory card inside so I can show y'all some footage with the new camera because I'm sure y'all wanna see a comparison, right? And I know you probably wanna know what I'm using right now, but once I switch camera, I'll show you and next I'm going to add the battery to the camera and I'm so happy that the battery on this camera is the same battery as my current Sony camera so I can use these simultaneously because I have so many different batteries that's bomb also I'm going to add this light to the camera look at this y'all this light right here is everything. I love this light. So I'm gonna go ahead and attach it to the horseshoe on the camera. That's official, baby. My new vlog setup. So let's go ahead and turn this camera on for the first time. The on switch is right here on top. Hopefully the camera's been charged. It might not be. Oh no. I don't think it has a charge. I'm so glad that this uses the same battery as my current camera because I'm gonna pop this baby right on in so we can turn this camera on because it did not come charged. So let's take the lens cap off and it's on. So it's asking me the language. Let's do English. Connect your smartphone via Bluetooth and set up your camera's initial settings. Okay, I'm gonna set up this camera and I'll be right back. So I went ahead and I set up this camera. So it is now filming. Let's go ahead and switch these up so you can see exactly what I mean. Do y'all hear this? put the new camera on and now somebody has the fire alarm going off and it's somebody smoking in their apartment like come on I know chuckles I know baby come here come here I'll be back shortly So here is the current camera that I've been using to shoot all of my YouTube videos as of late and this is the Sony A7C and I have the Samyang 24F 1.8 lens on top as well as this Rode video microphone. So if any of you are interested in the current camera that I'm using or this lens or this setup right here. I'm gonna leave everything linked in my Amazon storefront so you can check it out. I know that when I first started on YouTube, there wasn't a lot of information on cameras and things of that sort. So I hope that this video helps some of you out. I wanted to unbox and share my new vlogging camera setup and I feel like the quality is better, but let's give it a go. I really need to see it on my computer to see if the quality is better or not. You can let me know if you see a difference between the Sony ZV-E1, which is the camera that I'm currently shooting on now, versus the footage of the 7C, which is what I've been using for my YouTube videos. I feel like the autofocus on this camera is so much better, like, it just looks so good and you can really get up close and personal. And my other camera 
you cannot get this close and it be in focus. If you would like to see more videos like this on how I shoot and film and edit my YouTube videos, then definitely give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed and make sure you click that bell so all of your notifications are turned on so you don't miss an upload from me. For those of you who watch this video to the very end, thank you so much. I am shooting the audio on just the camera body on the new camera. And for my 7C, I've been shooting it with the video mic because I feel like the on body camera mic is not as good so I'm gonna be testing out this microphone on here as well if I need to use an external mic I definitely will by the way if you have not checked out my last get ready with me video definitely do that I am looking much more glam than I am right now so I'm gonna leave the link right here for y'all to go check it out